Okay, so I just wanted to do a quick interview here with Minu, who um, is uh, going to be getting ready for her first, uh, she's getting ready for her first Spartan race. What made you decide to want to do a Spartan race? How you're feeling? What you're doing for your training? And any thoughts you have about it? Okay, so um, the reason I'm doing it is basically I wanted to see if I can do it. Okay. And um, how I'll feel doing it. Feeling quite nervous. Uh -huh. yeah. I'm a little scared. Mostly, um, I don't want to get injured. That's yeah. my biggest fear. Okay. And um, for training, I started doing the OCR training this year mm -hmm. on Tuesdays, and I'm coming to these um, basic OCR basics to learn my skills. And then um, just my regular workouts here. You're trying to get ready for a Spartan race, doing. Just normal strength and conditioning workouts are great to help you build the strength to do some of the obstacles, conditioning to get through the endurance of just getting through the race because 80, 90% of it is running. So doing a lot of you know trail runs and just working on your cardio is a great way just to prepare yourself for one of these races. And then like today, we're here at Basics, which is um, obstacle basics where we're just learning some technique on how to do the obstacles. We'll practice it a bit. Tuesday nights is the SGX program. That's where we mix the obstacle course with a circuit and uh, work on some of the Spartan philosophies on training. Um, so yeah, so your first race is coming up. Sunday, next week. Next week, you've got Sunday. That's the San Jose race. You're doing the super or the sprint? The sprint. The sprint, so the Sunday sprint which is about uh, four miles. So after the race, we're gonna check back in. Right after? <laughs> right after. <laughs> maybe, maybe we might, I might even interview her oh, during God. the race at some point, checking <laughs> no. in to see how she's doing. Okay. <laughs> and then after the race. All right, well thank you. Thank Good you. luck. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. you ready? You ready for this? I'm ready to go. Good job, Mimi. Got it. Got it. How's it feeling? Great. You like it? I love it. Halfway First through the sprint. Just past mile two. Woo! Feeling Feel good. Strong? Confident. Yes. She just conquered the what? The Six foot monkey wall? bars. And oh, the and the monkey bars. Yeah. And the invertible. Yeah. Yeah. Let's Woo! keep going. You got it. Just walk your feet. Try walking your feet. You're doing great. Able to do that. Oh wow! Yeah, so it's really just your 
just excited and I just look for it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's, that's what we do, we train for the races, and that's what's awesome to see, is not knowing that you could do certain obstacles and what you're really capable of, and then you go out there, you do a race, and um, you find out all these things that you're able to do, uh, which is so empowering and awesome to see. Um, so really quick, how did you find Obstacle Course, and what was it about it that um, you know inspired you to try it out? Um, so uh, I was looking for something to challenge me and also I wanted to basically um, get stronger. I didn't want to just you know, go to the gym and lift weights and work out, but I wanted to actually feel stronger mm -hmm. and um, it's definitely helped me um, get there. Cool. Yeah. Great. And uh, I think, um, you know, even if you don't feel like you're ready, for example, for a race, you should just do it. <laughs> yes, Team Obstacles. <laughs> Great, well thank you for, um, yeah, you're welcome. Um, and that is it for our, our member spotlight of the month. Uh, come try out Obstacles, get your training in, and try out as partners. Do it.